everybody welcome back to my youtube channel welcome back to another video so today's video this is probably one of my favorite times of the year and today's video i thought it would be fun just to show you some of my okay i'm not sure what i'm going to call it yet but transitional neutral key pieces for a bit of a spring capsule wardrobe. That's what we're gonna go for. I'm not sure what the title of this video is gonna be, but obviously you'll know that by now. But I've got a beautiful selection of neutral, really tonal pieces for a really kind of clean, crisp spring wardrobe. So we're obviously still in February, but we're gonna be transitioning soon into spring. And I thought it was about time to bring you this video. So if you're excited for it, please do give it a big old thumbs up. And without further ado, let's get into it. So. I am going to be trying all of these pieces on for you and for frame of reference I am typically a UK size 8 or a size small depending on the retailer and I am 5 foot 6. I will also link everything in the description box below. Um, some of the things might be similar items because some of the things are slightly older in my wardrobe but hopefully I'll be able to find some alternatives for you. So let's get started with the first piece and the first piece is just a basic plain white t-shirt. Now this t-shirt is from Arquette, I think it was about £35 but it is a really really thick good quality white t-shirt and I've washed this 100,000 times and I do need to wash it again because I've got makeup on it. Um, but this kind of white t-shirt is an absolute must, it's a staple classic piece for a spring wardrobe. This one I love because it's not see-through at at all. I know sometimes white t-shirts if they're a bit thinner they can be a bit see-through and this one is completely protected which is really great. I went for a size small in this one actually and it fits like a glove which hopefully you'll see in the try-ons. Um, but yeah I just think a uh, plain white t-shirt goes with so so many different pieces and it's just a real key staple to have this time of year. My next staple is something that you may have seen from a recent mango haul. I haven't worn this one yet, but I'm definitely going to, and it is this gorgeous, slightly oversized, grey knitted cardigan. Now, this one is a red cardigan, and it does have these beautiful kind of grey tortoiseshell buttons. I just think a cardigan is just perfect for this time of year. I mean, I like to move out of kind of chunky coats and scarves and all of those things as soon as I can into warm, but a little bit lighter weight items like these cardigans. Now this one I picked up in a size small and because it's this gorgeous light grey colour it will go with so many pieces in your wardrobe, it works really well with leather leggings, smarter trousers, jeans, all good stuff like that. Um, I am going to include a couple kind of outfit ideas within this video as well so you can see how these pieces mix and match interchangeably together but yeah I just think a grey cardigan is just a really really great piece for this time of year. The next piece is of course, this is more of an oatmeal colour I think, so an oatmeal colour chunky knitted jumper. We're still not out of the woods in terms of freezing cold weather, so I do think it's nice to still include a chunky knit within your transitional spring capsule wardrobe. This one is a H&M favourite of mine, I picked it up in a size small, I've worn it so much this past winter and it is slightly oversized with a bit of a kind of high neck which I really love and it is just so warm and comfortable. And something like this, moving into the spring I think is perfect to chuck over a pair of leggings, you can wear a pair of sunglasses, um, you can kind of dress it down and make it a bit more spring like by getting rid of the boots and maybe popping on some sandals or some heels or something with this um, for this time of year or some trainers or something would work well as well but having something a bit oatmeal um, goes with absolutely everything in your wardrobe and I feel like I'm going to say that about every single piece in this capsule wardrobe but you get the point everything works nicely together and I just wanted to feature this because it's been such a staple over the winter and I'm just going to love it come spring as well. Another thing worth picking up and adding to your wardrobe if you haven't already done so is a slightly finer knit jumper. So we're obviously all, I think at the moment still, living in chunkier, thicker jumpers obviously to give us that warmth. But moving into spring, we're not going to need quite as much warmth and quite as much thickness to our jumpers. So this one is a H&M basic, it's a size small and it's just a cream marl really fine knit 
sweater. Now, something like this is so, so easy to wear with jeans. You can wear it with blue jeans tucked in. You can wear this with skirts if you like a midi skirt like me. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I love a midi skirt. And otherwise, it's just really good and versatile to wear with other lighter weight trousers. Um, you can dress it down with joggers if you want to. You can pair it with a bit of like a mini skirt if you're into that as well. There are so many ways to wear it. And because it is slightly lighter weight, you're not gonna be quite as toasty and warm in it. So a lighter weight, finer knit sweater is a definite must. And I would also recommend going for either a black or a creamy neutral color as well. Okay, so one of my favorite things about spring and about this time of year is the blazer. So I absolutely love blazers and this one is actually a gorgeous grey linen blazer from Zara. I picked this one up last year. I got it a bit oversized in a size medium and I absolutely love it. It is such a beautiful colour and it is just gorgeous for this time of year. I love bringing lighter neutrals into my wardrobe and just feeling a bit more spring-like and a bit more kind of clean with my dress. So this one is gorgeous. I absolutely love the ruched sleeve detail on this blazer as well. It just adds something else. I think if you are trying to build a more capsule kind of minimal wardrobe, then something you might want to consider is going for classic pieces. But if you want to update your wardrobe throughout the seasons, then maybe pick up a piece with a slightly different piece of detail on it. For example, these ruched sleeves, because it updates the look, but it also keeps it timeless at the same time. Now this one I love because it's very relaxed. It doesn't have any buttons or anything and it is literally the type of blazer you can chuck on over a little cami or a vest or something like that and it really finishes off and dresses up an outfit okay so i've got three pairs of bottoms in this capsule wardrobe and the first pair is of course the leather leggings these are coming with us into spring well they're definitely coming with me anyway because i absolutely love them i live in them and these ones are the trusty top shop leather leggings i put these ones up true to size in a size eight and they fit perfectly now the top shop leather leggings they are slightly thicker and slightly warmer so come the spring i probably will be wearing these with loafers and with kind of pumps and sandals and things like that rather than chunky black boots because I think we need a bit of air and a bit of circulation but again these are really really easy pair of trousers to wear because having the black means that it's going to go with any other colour and any other kind of neutral tone and texture that you're wearing on the top so really really easy to wear so easy to build outfits around the leather leggings if you do want to see a bit of a leather legging styling video that I have done one recently on my YouTube channel that I will try and link somewhere up here like people do. <laughs> but yeah, love my leather leggings. I'm going to be wearing them all the way into spring as well. So these next pair of trousers are a new addition to my wardrobe and they are a slightly more formal, creamy, lighter colour trousers. So these are very light. Um, these ones were from ASOS and they're actually from Topshop um, via ASOS, which I love. And these ones are definitely more of a thinner material, I would say. Um, I would say these are the kind of trousers that, ooh, these are the kind of trousers where you can't really wear dark underwear underneath because you're definitely going to see it <laughs> um but i think having a lighter more neutral kind of this is like a really 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 light camel color pair of tailored trousers in your wardrobe is just going to work really nicely for the springtime i love pairing neutrals with neutrals i think it looks really chic and then i also love pairing black with colors like this because it just shows off the contrast and works really really nicely and looks really effortless I would maybe wear this with a lightweight fine knit black jumper or a black t-shirt and um, something like that or maybe even a black kind of vest top with the blaze over the top. I think that would also look pretty nice with an open toe pair of shoes. So yeah, I think just a slightly more formal tailored pair of trousers in a lighter colour are a really good buy for spring. Something else that I'm loving and would recommend for this coming spring is a pair of camel trousers. Now these ones are high waisted, they're from Motel Rocks and I love them. They're a pair of camel formal trousers but they do have a bit of a wide leg as you can see and a bit of a slit detail as well. So that's what I'm talking about in terms of buying pieces that are they're classic pieces but this piece for example is just brought into the spring by having this slit at the bottom it just brings it a little bit more up to date um, and a little bit more on trend as well but yet it's still going to be timeless and they're going to be a pair of trousers that you're going to be able to wear time and time again 
I love the quality of these trousers. The quality is unbelievable. I haven't really shopped at Motel Rocks before, but I've bought a couple of things and I absolutely loved them. So I can definitely recommend. Um, the sizing is a little bit funny, so make sure you check out the size guide because I picked up these in a, what are these? Da, 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 da. I think they might be like an extra small. Yeah, they're an extra small um, and normally I'm a UK size 8 and they fit me perfectly. So make sure you do check out the sizes. But again, I think a camel pair of trousers. These ones are slightly longer, but they are high-waisted. Absolutely love them. You can pair them with jumpers, you can pair them with vests long sleeve tops anything really and they're just gonna work for this time of year really really well so in terms of keeping warm and getting not getting rid but minimizing the big old chunky woolly coats in our wardrobes and um, i'm gonna be wearing my leather jacket so this is a leather jacket from mango i sized up and went for a size medium i'm normally a size small in mango but I did want this one to be a little bit oversized. I got this one back in the autumn and it's one of the best buys I've made, I think. I absolutely love it. A leather jacket is just such a timeless piece and you can pretty much wear it any time of year, apart from summer when you might bake. <laughs> but it's really versatile, really easy. We'll go over all of these pieces that I picked up in this kind of little capsule wardrobe today. And it's just nice and interchangeable and something a little bit more fun to add to a spring wardrobe. And then in terms of coats, we're going a little bit lighter weight with a lighter weight trench. Now this one is from Mango and it is this gorgeous camel colour. Again, I picked this one up about a year ago now probably and I've worn it time and time again. It's a really classic waterfall detail with a tie waist and then it has pockets and kind of a lot of detail going on which I absolutely love. I did go true to size with this one and start with the size small and um, but a kind of a, a lighter weight trench is something that's really easy to throw on over any outfit it just elevates it slightly and also gives you another layer of warmth without making you boil in a kind of wool coat or something so trenches are really really easy if you wanted a lightweight one to add to your spring wardrobe i think it's such a good idea and i'm going to be living in this one so make sure you check out my instagram to have a little look and see how i'm going to be styling it and that's everything for today's video guys i really hope you liked it and found some inspiration for your transitional spring capsule wardrobe if you did enjoy the video i'd love it if you gave it a big old thumbs up which was your favorite item leave me a comment down below and let me know and if you are new to my channel feel free to hit that subscribe button for new videos every single week from me i'm hoping to upload three every single week so fingers crossed we manage to do that so thank you so much for watching guys and i'll see you in the very next video bye